I should just film everything because you never know what I'm gonna use. You thirsty. Oh, you're spilling it on me. Oh, oh, you're spilling it. Here, drink it out of my hand. No. Now there's just water everywhere. I'll give you more water when we're done. Don't be a diva. Okay, you guys. So, hello and welcome. This is part two of my wish mystery box. I talked too much in the first one, but I didn't want to take it out because I think I made an interesting statement. So we'll leave it there. But I started opening the wish mystery bundle and I have so many more to go. And I also promised you a little story about my future Halloween videos. So I'll tell you about that and how pissed off I am. The first, let, let's see what this is, because I don't know if I could talk and open it. But what the hell? So I was gonna go, I'm going ghost hunting. I already promised that on my channel. There's no turning back. I'm one of those people, if I say I'm gonna do something, I'm gonna do it. You know what I'm not gonna do is wear this. What is this? Is this like a bralette? There's no way. There's no way I could fit into this. That's like, a boob. That's a boob. May maybe a boob and a half. What if a guy ordered this thing? <laughs> like, what? I know. Like, this is a cute bralette. I don't wear bralettes. I need support. Okay. <laughs> I need support for these things. Uh, but uh, charity it is. Um, I'm going ghost hunting. Do I believe in ghosts? <sighs> Skeptical. I've been ghost hunting before. I actually have a ghost hunting video. It didn't come out very good. I'm not like, I'm not like proud of it. I'm opening this. Um, but I did make one. I did go to a haunted place and I did, oh my God, this is just not going well. Um, but I'm going to go ghost hunting again for you, for this channel, for me, let's be honest. It's for me to share with you. Um, and oh, good Lord. Oh, oh, okay, wait. These are hair scrunchies. They're kind of cute, actually. They're a little bit too big for my hair, but I could probably throw these in some giveaways because they're kind of cute, I think. And they're used, their son is actually a usable thing. My hair is so fine that I need like really tight bands. These are a little bit, these are more, they're not quite scrunchies, but they're like elastic scrunchy. I don't know what I'm trying to say. They're tighter scrunchies, but anyways, look at them all. I'm just gonna randomly throw them in giveaways because, I don't know. Well, if you get one, you get one. <laughs> um, so I was gonna go ghost hunting quite soon, very soon. I wanna go before it, the, the haunted places around here are swamped with people because I want to be alone. All right. I'd rather deal with dead people than live people. But as far as if I believe in ghosts, it's to be seen. Literally, I need to see something. Experience. I hear stories and I'll see. I've never witnessed anything myself. Not that I don't believe people. I just. Wow. You want to talk about fancy ass socks? Is that what these are? Yeah. These are some fancy socks. How can you walk in these though? Did they not think that through? Oh no. Okay. The bottoms, the bottoms of the socks are not bedazzled, but the rest of them are. <laughs> hey, Phoenix, come here. Oh, he's over it. He's done. You guys asked me, where's Phoenix? Phoenix doesn't always want to hang out in the videos. I don't know if it's the lighting or this room or whatever, but these socks are both hideous and glorious at the same time. It's like a throwback to the eighties. Like the eighties puked on these socks. You tell me what I should do with them. Donate them, give away, burn them. I'm not going to wear them. They're not my style. I don't know if anyone's style is this. <laughs> okay, I keep trying to get to the story of the of the haunted thing. So, okay, so I had a partner. To, I'm not gonna name names. I don't wanna like get in trouble. I had a partner that was gonna go with me 
because who wants to go ghost hunting alone? That's freaking terrifying. My partner backed out for bullshit reasons, and I shouldn't be surprised because this partner that I'm speaking of, not my husband, someone else, always does this to me. Always. So I'm not surprised. But I thought this person would be interested to go for their own reasons because they want to do it. Not for me, but because they wanted to do it. But now they're not doing it. My husband won't do it because he says he's not, he doesn't believe in that stuff. But he doesn't want to go. I think he's scared. Um, it's a mirror. Say hi. Wait. Ah. This mirror is dirty, not the phone. It's the mirror. My phone is clean. I clean my phone religiously. Here's the back. Wait. I thought maybe it was a nail thing. You know, like how people stamp their nails. Titus, why? Why when I'm filming? But it's like smooth. Here's a stupid thing. Um, so now... I told you guys I was gonna go ghost hunting and I wanna go ghost hunting. I also told you guys I don't have any friends. I have a, I have a couple friends, but none of my friends would wanna do that. Um, oh my gosh, these are so cute. Look at these baby socks. Oh my God, they're adorable. I don't know anybody I could give these to, so. Maybe like a donation, but they're so cute though. Oh, so cute. Um, so anyways, I'm going to be going ghost hunting by myself in a place that is known to be haunted. I'm going to bring Titus, um, and some hunt ghost hunting, maybe some ghost hunting equipment. And my gun, because I don't play around, all right? I don't want to be messed with. I worry about, what in the world is this? I worry about the wildlife. I've had very, I don't even know what this is. Are these rubber buttons? See, this is more like what I was expecting from a wish mystery bag. They look like rubber buttons. I don't know how else to explain them. Does anyone know? Are these notions for sewing? I don't know what they are, but they're soft and squishy, but they have like two holes in them. But one hole is like longer than the other hole. Can you see that? I don't know. If anyone knows what this is, I'm all ears. Anyways, so I'm going ghost hunting by myself. Nobody wants to go with me. It's fine, whatever. Um, it's happening soon because you don't have to go in October. If a place is haunted, it's always haunted. It's not just haunted in the fall or it's not just haunted sometimes. It's always haunted. <laughs> oh, we got some jewelry. That was uh, to be expected. Oh, what is that? What is this though? Okay, hold on, what is it? What am I looking at? Oh, it's a tree of life. Okay, I'm gonna have to take it out of the plastic because, okay, first of all, I don't wear jewelry. Um, second of all, this is like really cheap costume jewelry, but it's kind of pretty though. Like if I was into jewelry, I would probably wear the necklace. I don't have my ears pierced. I've, uh, I've had very bad experiences as a child having my ears pierced. Here's the necklace. Can you see that? Is it focusing well enough for you to make that out? And then I guess this is a bracelet. Yeah. So this is a bracelet with the tree of life on it. I don't know what I'm going to do with this either. I don't wear jewelry. Except for my wedding ring. I used to have my tongue pierced. This is how it would work. This is how it would clasp on. Like that. And then a little like this. And then you're ready to go. Um, what should I do with this? You guys tell me. I have no idea. 
donation? Hmm? What? Does anybody want it? Huh? Um, when I was like seven, I had my ears pierced and my uncle um, was chasing me around a table. He was horrible. <laughs> he was so mean to me. He was chasing me around a table and I banged my ear. Yeah, it was this one. I banged my ear into the table and it, swole, it got swollen up and I told my mom and she's like, oh, you're fine. Oh, you're fine. Well, the skin grew over the earring and I had to have it like, I had to have like my earlobe cut open so they could remove the earring. That didn't deter me. When I was older, oh my God, we have more socks. I think that's what these are. Socks. Like, like these are like fancy like dress socks. I'm not even gonna take them out of the packaging, but they're like fancy dress, fancy, cr wait. These are not socks. Tiffany, pay attention. This is gonna be a three part video. Oh my God, Tiffany, shut up. <laughs> but anyway, so I had my ears pierced again when I was older and I was getting a perm. And I got perm solution in my freshly pierced hole. And I took the earrings out. I threw them across the room because I was childish. And I said I would never pierce my ears again. Is that what this is? This is the only thing I could think of. I can't imagine this even fitting on a leg. It's like, is this like a compression arm thing or is this a fashion thing? I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what this is. It's, it does compress whatever, whatever it's supposed to do. It like, it squeezes. And I now have four sets of them. Great. But then anyway, so after that, uh, when I turned 18, I got my tongue pierced <laughs> and I had my tongue pierced for eight years. And then I, oh, there's a bunch in here. And then I, um, and then I ended up uh, taking it out after eight years. Mostly because, first of all, I went, I, after my tongue healed and stuff, I went with, um, plastic, plastic balls, like on the top and bottom instead of metal, because it would, if you hit your teeth, it really hurt. And... This is mascara. These are two sets of waterproof mascaras. I don't ever recommend anyone ever using products that are from Wish that are cosmetics. I'll use them though. And I'll let you know if uh, an eye falls out or something. Um, what were we talking about? Oh, and then sometimes in my sleep, I would accidentally swallow one of the balls. Like it would un, it's like a corkscrew, like a screw, like they're screwed on. But in my sleep, I don't know what my tongue was doing, but the ball, I would end up swallowing it. And I would in the morning, I'd be like, what the hell? Not only that, but if you do not clean your tongue, your tongue rings very often, which would, in my case was boiling them, um, they would acquire plaque, just like your teeth. It's gross. So you gotta be like very fastidious about hygiene, which I am, but it just got to be like, after eight years of doing that, I was just like over it. So there, now you know about my weird piercing story. What is that? Who's gonna wear this? First of all, okay. The material, where does this zip? Okay, so it zips in the back. And then the front has buttons and it has, it has like a, a tie around. I know this is for an adult, but this looks like it could fit a child and they're shorts and they're really, really cheap, cheap, very, very thin material. These would be cute if they were a different material, but this is wish we're talking about. <laughs> um, so I'm going to have to leave the video there because again, I just, these are going to be very chatty, long, probably boring, <laughs> random mystery box openings from Wish. So I'm going to leave that there. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.